and welcome to the Austin Physio YouTube channel. For today's video, we are gonna show you how to trigger point release your rotator cuff muscles. The role of your rotator cuff muscles in your body is to add stability to the glenohumeral joint, so your shoulder joint. So the main areas that we want to trigger point release when they get really sore is around the belly of the muscles, the attachments of the muscles and where they blend around the front and around the side of the humerus. What we want to have a look at is adding the trigger point ball around the scapulae, inside and outside to release that soreness and tightness that can build up if we're rounding the shoulders or we use the shoulder a lot during the day. So we want to start by feeling around the shoulder to find a knot or a point of tenderness. Once we've found that point we want to add the trigger point ball onto that area. You want to gently drop your body back adding pressure until we take the pain to approximately 8 out of 10 and we'll feel the pain peak and we want to hold that until it relaxes until we feel the pain stop. You see here we can also apply it a little bit higher but any points around the shoulder great at the end of a crazy long day to relax tension. 